Hey YouTube, gonna have a fun little break here. Just got this in the mail today. It's a it's an eBay buy. I don't usually buy these off eBay. I got a got a fun little box of Topps Fire. Um, <clears throat> not too terribly expensive. I think I paid a hundred bucks shipped. So I'm, well, ninety four dollars shipped. I think it was something like that. So not too bad. I'm struggling with my camera here a little bit, I'm trying to find the right. Maybe that'll do. Yeah, we'll work with that. <clears throat> Don't usually buy Tops Fire, but I mean, well, I take that back. I buy it, but I usually buy like a pack or two, you know, maybe three or four. I don't usually buy a whole lot of this product, but the year that we're in right now and the way things are going, I'm buying a lot of lower end product as far as hobby boxes are concerned, just because, man, I just two hundred fifty dollars for a hobby box of Tops Chrome is absolutely nuts, and I am just not going to contribute to that kind of crazy, but. Uh, <clears throat> figure out what I'm going to do with my uh, my scissors here. Well, I got them. Here we go. So I figured, out hey, this will be a fun enough break. And rather than spending 250 for a, a Topps Chrome Hobby Box or 500 bucks or whatever it is, 400 bucks for a, a Jumbo Box, I'll just pick out the cards I want and just go nuts. So maybe we can just, you know, it's fun to open packs, though. you got to open packs. It's always just, I mean, if you're into the hobby itself and not just the business, you got to open packs. That looks awesome. Everything looks like it should be, you know, clean and not damaged, right? That makes me nervous. Uh, oh well. We'll see what kind of luck do we have. It's Tops Fire, so, you know. All at the same time, though, I say lower end products. I wouldn't be surprised if Tops Big League turns into some. I mean, flagship rookie, you know, Chase flying off the shelf situation next year. I mean, who the heck knows? But uh, this comes with two autographs in it, so that'll be fun. We'll see if I can... I don't usually get a whole lot of really good autograph love. I pull the better autographs out of retail. Every time I buy um, hobby boxes with guaranteed hits, you know, it's always Bob Nobody. Every time. <clears throat> I think I've had a few good pulls, you know, but my best ones have come out of the most bizarre places. Anyways, moving on. There's Olsen. Yeah, I'm in Kata. Man, those, the, 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 the look of these is just sweet. I really like them. I don't know why I don't buy them. Well, I probably don't buy them much because it's a Target deal typically, and I don't go to Target a lot. Chris Bryant and Calhoun. Not for any reason other than there isn't one in my town, so I have to go to the next town over to go, go to Target. And it's just not super convenient. And then when I get there, you know, if Topps Fire's on the shelf and Topps Chrome's on the shelf, guess what I'm buying? There's Hater. A red rookie there, LeMayhew, and Mendick. Yeah, Danny Mendick. Hmm, it's cool. Hopefully he turns into something. I got an auto of him over here somewhere. Clevenger, Belt, and Zimmerman. Nothing to really write home about just yet. I don't even know what I'm hoping for. I mean, this, you know, the typical, hope I get a Louis Robert autograph rookie or a, you know... I don't know, maybe a Jordan Alvarez or a Bo Bichette. Probably a Bo Bichette would be my number two. There's Betts, Sano. Is that? Yeah, that's Bellinger. Power, Power and Pride. That's a cool card. Uh, Faro, Turner, and Cobb. <clears> the <throat> only reason I hate, hate buying these off eBay for the most part you know, somebody cracked a case, opened up the box, got a monster hit, and said, yep, selling everything else, because the best card in this group is right here. But I don't know where they got them or how many they had, so who knows. What is that, Didi Gregorius? Yeah. Bagwell. Correa. And Jordan, Jordan Yamamoto. That's a cool one. He may be something. I don't know. We'll see. I don't put a whole lot of... <laughs> Excuse me. Whole lot of uh, finger crossing into uh, pitchers. Got the game on in the background right now. It's uh, seven to seven between the Titans and the Broncos. Looks like Drew Lock has the ball and he just dropped it. I don't know if you guys are watching or even care, but that's what's up in my house. There's Dylan Cease, Eovaldi. We got here flamethrowers, Max Scherzer. He might be my favorite pitcher. He's 
I, I think in this day and age, it, it battles for most people between Scherzer and Verlander and maybe Kershaw. Kershaw falls to number three for me, though, simply because of uh, his postseason faux pas. But he's a great, I mean, he's a great, great pitcher. Don't get me wrong. You got Garrett Cole on the rise. <clears throat> All right. Who's this? Brasso. Guzman. Jacob DeGrom. Michael Brousseau. Brandon Crawford. Seeger. Smith. Honestly, this break sucks so far, guys. Uh, there's, I'm at that point right now where I'm like, eh. If it goes much more like this, I probably won't even post it. Wouldn't be worth it. It'd just be making you guys sit through a torturous video going, I can't believe I sat through that. I didn't even get the luxury of pulling any of the cards and I just watched a bunch of crap. At least there's a bow. Got a, got a bow, so that's cool. There's Gallo. Oh, man. It's got to be an Altuve. And it's a numbered one out of two ninety nine. Jeez, Robles. Uh, Fulton the Wits. I don't know if I said that right. Probably not. And Abreu. These are these are cool enough. I'd maybe be willing to buy another one. I don't know. They're nice, but there's Hilliard. I'll probably stop with this one now. AJ Puck, red, not numbered. There's Lindor, Muncie, and Acuna. Bakuna Matata. Oop. Let's see what kind of embarrassing rookies, rookie autos they, well, and they may not even be rookies because I've seen some of the autos come out that are second year. Uh, <clears throat> a buddy of mine opened up a box, and what was his? He got a, uh, oh, a Keston Hira. It's Hoskins. And Ricky Henderson. Luriano. Anderson. And Nico. I'll set Nico aside. I think Nico's going to be pretty good. Hard to tell, but I mean, sometimes we judge on it factor. Sometimes we judge on stupid things. Sometimes I think they just have a cool name. <laughs> Sounds like a name that might be in the Hall of Fame one day. I don't know if Nico will, but there's Bregman. There's Kopech. There's an Otani. Power and Pride. Springer. Quintana. And Granky. Not having a heck of a lot of luck here. I mean, I mean, we're not even pulling good, good rookies. We got a Bobus Chet and a Nico Horner. <clears throat> All right, Dubon, low. There's a Judgey in the red. It's a nice shiny Judge. That one's for you, there, Lou. Ah, there's Wit. There's my guy. Not a shiny. Huh. Nick Solak and Trevor Bauer. Alright. So now we got, man, I don't know. Oh, DJ Carrasco? Is that? No, Carlos Carrasco. Oh boy. That's kind of sweet. Look at that. Out of 99, Pete Alonzo. Not having the toughest year, greatest year, whatever. But that's a sweet card. I mean, this is an autograph out of 99 of a Rookie of the Year dude. I'll take that. I have a little faith in him. Ichiro. All right. So, one down. And it's an out of 99, so... Somebody somewhere... He's loving that card. <laughs> it's my second Alonzo uh, autograph now that I think about it, too. I've got the, uh, which one? Topps Chrome Rookie Auto from last year. Goldschmidt, Buxton, there's Shane Bieber. I think he, yeah, he's on the rise, too. He's he's coming up. I, I've been digging through some uh, rookie boxes, and I just pulled this one out today, and I have about ten more of them, too. So, <clears throat> in fact, no, that's not the same picture. Nope, never mind. Mike, I'm being dumb-dumb. Uh, let's see, Su Sugo, Riv oh, Mar hey, there's Marano, Mariano, Blah. I can't speak tonight, so you'll have, have to forgive me. All right. Still got another auto coming. What are the odds we can go two for two and get a couple of good names? Ray, 
Cano. Set. That's different. Throw throw to home. Aaron Hicks. I'm not sure who that is. That's hmm, Tony Gwynn. Uh, Yamaguchi. And Gon Gonzalin. I, I swear I know baseball. I know players. And every time I open packs, I see a name where I'm like, who is that? All right. <clears throat> There's Pete. We'll just put those side by side because that stuff just looks cool. Braun. There's McKay. That's pretty nice. Brendan McKay. Tatis. Lincecum. And done. There is a McCutcheon on the back. Let's see. Steven Strasburg. I personally think this guy's on a on a Hall of Fame trajectory. Kim. Italian, Talon, Austin Meadows, Baez, and McCutcheon. Man, uh, uh, other than that, Pete, this is a weak box. Weak, weak, weak. Damn. <laughs> Pardon my French if there's kids watching. That is French for this box is not good. Uh, Contreras. There's Lords Guriel Jr. There's Garrett Cole. Uh, Freeland. Kyle Freeland, yeah. Barry Zito. And Means, Means, what was his first name? Yeah, John Means. He was, what, number two in Rookie of the Year voting last year. Down to three packs left, and we've got an auto in one of them. Cross your fingers for a Robert, right? I doubt it, but I'll cross them anyways. And it ain't in this pack. Munoz, Sale, uh, Bradley Jr., there's a May. Go ahead and set that aside just because I need to feel good about this box. Nick Senzel, and... Akiyama. Shogo Akiyama. Maybe, maybe not. Let's go with this one. That was a... I got two packs to... I wouldn't say save the box, but to, you know, juice it up a little bit. Okay, there's Trouty. Oh, here we go. It's going to be a Matt Dice. Nothing special. Another... It's wrong angel. Should have been this one. Hmm. Right initials, right? Right initials. Wrong. Wrong MT angel. Let's see. Bell, Castro, and Harper. So, kind of a big bust on, on the rookie autos. Let's see if we can even get a Robert. Um, nope. 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 Oop. Nope. Is this, uh... Yeah, that's who I thought, Bregman. About some of the coolest shit that I... Pardon my French. Yet again, I'm sorry. I'll bleep it. Well, maybe. I don't know if I know how to bleep it. Um, some of the coolest stuff I pull are friggin' Astros. So, a real quick recap. I mean, real quick recap. These are the best rookies I got. The best ones, right? Bichette, Horner, and May. So, big, fat, juicy bust. And then we got a Matt Dice, Stace, I don't know how you say that. Tice, Otto, a Pete Alonzo, Otto, and, meh, well, just for kicks and giggles. We'll keep that clean. We got a Raw Alonzo. So, really, just five decent cards. Uh, maybe I think there was a couple other numbered things in here, like an Altuve and, you know... Not much else. Here we go. Cut right to it. There's the Altuve. If you're interested in that sort of thing, out of two ninety nine. So that's about it. That's about it. So man, I can't say I don't recommend the product because it is cool. Your break's got to be better than mine. So hell, take a chance. All right, guys. I'm out. Have a good night.